So several of you have asked me to make a video showcasing all of the recolors that I have and I guess basically as a guide of like some some also wanted as a guide to showcase what has been released as recolors and you guys can have an idea of what 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 there is out there available so or what has been released previously so I'm going to start with Legends, Legend Recolors. Again, this is going to be only about Recolors, and then I'll do the loadout. So, for, for Bloodhound, there are three Recolors, of which I have two. So there is Raven, Raven's Shadow. So please remember that I am missing five Recolors. That's all what I'm missing in the game. Uh, so this one is Raven's Shadow, second recolor for Bloodhound. And then we have Wandering Warrior, which was released at the beginning of Season 4. And this is the third recolor. Then we have Gibraltar. Gibraltar has soft power, considered for many as a very rare recolor. As it was the, the very first one. And then we have three more. Code Red it's quite, uh, it's quite nice, I like the, the shield here Then we have Redwood Raider And finally Shell Shocked So Definitely my favorite one is Soft Power It's really really cool and I like all the colors on it uh, By far my favorite amongst the three colors then we have Lifeline. First recorder is Lifeline Bling. So this is, was the first recorder for her. Then we have First Responder. This part here is quite nice. It's quite cool. Then third recorder is Balance Shift. I think my favorite part is the, the ropes, the color of the ropes here. And then last but not least, we have Rejuvenation. This was the last recolor for her. Uh, this one was released about a month ago. Let's put this sticker here. All right. Then we have Pathfinder. So Pathfinder only has three recolors. So we have Green Machine. I think this is this was the very first one. No, actually, uh, Board of Gold. This was the first recorder for Pathfinder. Board of Gold, and then it was Green Machine, and then last but not least, it was Pole Position. So Pathfinder with a total of three recorders. That's, that's what has been released for him. Then we have Wraith. So Wraith has four recorders, of which I have three. Airship Assassin, I don't have it. Then the second one was Flashpoint. Uh, I love this recorder. I really, really love the, the colors, everything on it. And it makes her look like such a badass character. Um, it's, it's a really cool recorder and it's one of my favorite. Some people say that Airship Assassin, those that have it say that it's not that great. It's obviously extremely rare, but the colors in themselves are not that great. These colors here on Flashpoints, I really love them. I really like them and they make her look really cool. Then the second one was Final Sunset. Another cool recolor, pretty nice recolor. Everything on, everything on it is, is quite cool. Good choices of colors there. And then last one is Depth of the Void. So we have this there. Quite cool skin. And actually, I'm going to add, even though it doesn't have the recolor symbol, this skin, Voices from the Past, is a recolor of Night Terror. There you go. So this one is a recolor, but it doesn't have the recolor symbol. So that's an extra 
recolor cosmetic. All right. Then we have Bangalore. She has full metal jacket. Very first recolor for her. And then cherry bomb. Really cool recolor. It's a unique recolor. Why? Because the base skin doesn't have these cherry leaves. So it's a I think I think is the only is the is the only recolor that has something added to the base legendary cosmetic. Then we have Killer B, another nice recorder, quite rare, and mint condition. It's quite decent, quite a decent recorder. Then let's move off, move on to Caustic. Very first recorder for Caustic, the Trophy Hunter. Then we have Dark Cloud. And then as a third recorder is Waste Management. Not my favorite design, my favorite choice of colors here. Not quite into it. Then Mirage. Mirage has a total of three recolors. The first one, I don't have it, so I'm gonna go... No, sorry, this is the first one, the Dark, the dark Artist. So it's the second one, I missed it, just by not having like 600 Apex tokens. So that was quite sad. So Dark Artist, first recorder for him. And then second one, uh, third one, this is the third recorder, Folkiro. So the second, I the second one I missed. Oh, sorry, there's one more. And Pig Crew. There we go. I think my favorite part is just the the purple beard. So I make what makes this skin stand out the most, I guess. Then we have Octane with a total of four recorders. Starting with Redshift, a uh, skin, a recorder that is being asked a lot in this channel by many people that it should definitely come back is extremely rare, extremely rare. This and is a really cool recorder. It's one of those recorders that stand out, and I could easily give this recorder. Yeah, I would definitely give it a, like a 10 out of 10 because the. the the choice of colors and the design is everything is great on it, so definitely a 10 out of 10. Then we have Extreme Measure, second recolor for him. Another cool recolor, really, really cool. Nice choice of colors, everything on it is it stands out, really cool. Then we have Surplus Acceleration, then the, the quality starts going down. No, not my favorite design or my favorite choices of colors, and then Whole Shot, Hot Shot. Again, some people liked it. I, I don't like it particularly. So that's four recorders for Octane. Then Watson has three recorders. So let's start with Bionic Wonder. This is not the first one, but it's a really cool one. I think uh, Watson is about to get another recorder, a red one, and that one is going to. That one looks amazing. So if you guys have the base legendary skin, totally go for it and collect it. This was the very first one for Watson, current champ, and then Vaporwave. Really cool, really cool skin. Then we have, then we have uh, Crypto. Crypto is also going to get another recorder, so keep an eye on that. It's going to be a similar design to this one, but instead of like orange, it's gonna be like a green. I'm gonna be making a video in like for tomorrow. Tomorrow's video is going to be me showcasing all the leaked skins that are coming, uh, like recorders and event skins. So I'll be showcasing that, and there is also going to be a video. Uh, there's going to be the season five video is going to be released in about. 
seven hours. So keep an eye on that because I'm going to make a reaction as well. So last one is fuzzy logic. It's an alright, alright recolor. Then to finalize the legends, the uh, we have uh, Revenant, but he has no recolors at all yet. There are two leak recolors for him, but they haven't been released. So that's everything for the legends. Um, five uh, of the legends. There are three, three recolors that I don't have, and of weapons of the loadout I don't have two. So a total, again, a total of five. So let's go with weapons. Flatline is got four recolors. The death rattle, the very first one. So this, that was a recorder for it. Then we have the th Thorn Rose. I don't like this recolor. Then this one, I quite like it. I like it a lot. Uh, Party Starter. And then finally, Cobble Expanse. I don't like this one either. It looks too too bland, too dim. Uh, the, the colors are a bit... Uh, they, don't, they don't stand out on this, on this recolor. So... Not my favorite. Then we have the G7 Scout. Uh, four recolors. The first one is Hidden Agenda. So, is this one there? Then we have, actually, let me show this case, this skin, the Blue Dragon, because this skin doesn't have a recolor symbol. It doesn't have any symbol at all, but it seems that you guys cannot craft it you guys cannot see it in your in your game in your inventory so um, I'm going to showcase this skin as well because it seems that is a is the rarest skin for the G7 then we have the second recolor is this one again the colors don't stand out it's a bit bit faded out then we have Vernon Wyvern mm, it's, it's all right but not not that great, and then this one is actually it's actually decent. It, the colors pop out a bit more on this one. Bloody bandage. Then we have the hemlock. So first recorder for the hemlock is the intensifier. This one is quite opposite, like too many. The colors stand out a lot. Really strong accents. Uh, we have forgotten odyssey. Uh, it's a cool recolor. It's a cool recolor. Yeah. And then finally, Mossy Hardware. Not bad. Not bad. Probably like a 5, five 6 out of 10. Then let's move on to the R301. So the very first recolor, the R301 has 5, 6 recolors I'm going to show you so you guys can see there's five but I'm going to show you a sixth recolor for for it so we have pale moonlight very first recolor for the R301 it's actually quite nice I like it I like this recolor uh, then we have retro retro causality I like this skin because of how slim how skinny it is and actually the colors I, I do like them as well they are quite nice choice, and I like this this part here, like some kind of flowers. Then third recorder for it, we have this one, intelligent intelligent design. Not a bad recorder. Then predatorial instincts, meh, is not as great as the pale moonlight. And then finally, enduring honor. Wait, well, actually, this they look quite similar. Then this one. Enduring Honor, and then I promised you a sixth recolor, so is this one. So I have the base skin, and they release a recolor, which is Trophy Collector. So it's a recolor of Honor Prey. So that's my sixth recolor for the R301. Then Havoc has one recolor here, the Entangler, very first recolor for it. Then one of my favorite colors for the Havoc is this one, the Polarizer. I love when the accents stand out. Uh, I think they make that's what makes some recolors great. Collision Curse, third recolor for it. 
and then finally warning signs what I love about this one is this this part here and the wooden the wooden section okay so submachine guns alternator he has the placebo effect this is the only recolor that has ever come back to the store the, the only one I uh, it was released at the kind of like two three weeks after the game was released and about a week or two weeks later that the, the recorder was issued it came out again so it's the only recorder that has ever come back and then again you guys ask me are recorders coming back will we will we have a chance of grabbing them of collecting them and my answer is yes i have always been positive i do believe that all recorders will come back at some point or the vast majority will come back i don't know when it may take a year it may take two years we ha have no no information about that but i i stay positive that they will definitely come back third recorder for the alternator code blue and palette cleanser i like this recorder i like it a lot then the prowler i have four recorders for the prowler this is the latest one cherry picker but there are actually five recorders so i'm missing the very first one that came out for the prowler then i have the final judgment i think this is the second recorder for the prowler then we have pathogen third recorder for the for the prowler and the tomb robber uh, fourth recorder and then the one I have, that I am wearing is the fifth recorder, Cherry Picker. The first one, I didn't get it. Then we have the R99 uh, Swift Justice. This is uh, what I have equipped at the moment. Is the latest recorder for the R99. If you have the chance and if you have the base legendary skin, go and, go and grab it. 10,508 bucks tokens. Then we have Magnum Opus. Uh, this is the very first recolor for the R99. Then we have the unloader, that uh, it really nice recolor with that iron side that we all like. So yeah, many people, including pro players, use this skin together with the, uh, this recolor, totally gnarly. So these are two recolors that are uh, preferred by many players. In this on this one, the colors stand out a bit more, especially on the on the top. So I guess. There are more people using this skin rather than rather than uh, the unloader. And then finally, we have Death Rio. This is the third recolor for the R99. Sorry, the yeah, this third recolor, third recolor, fourth recolor, totally gnarly, and Swift Justice is the fifth recolor for the R99. Okay. Now moving on to light machine guns, we have the devotion. So the very first recorder for the devotion, I don't have it, and that's my latest recorder that I'm not missing, a total of five. Then the second recorder for the devotion is this one, Bunny Hopper. Really cool skin. I love this um, uh, dice on the top. Um, it makes it look as a charm, which is a nice touch. But then we have Headhunter. I like this skin a lot, but what I don't like on this one is uh, the iron side. These two things is uh, this this uh, edge cock or whatever this iron side here. It doesn't it doesn't uh, it blocks a bit your view, so it's not that nice. Then we have Rising Tide, another cool recolor. It's actually quite nice, but it has that that iron side that I am not quite into. And then finally, we have Brass Rain. This is the latest recolor for the Devotion. Not that bad. Uh, moving on to Spitfire. First recolor for the Spitfire was Ground Control. Uh, I love the design of the Spitfire, and I used this recolor together with the base skin, which was Flying Warhawk. Yeah, I use this recolor a lot. I quite like it. Uh, it's quite, it's kind of clean, clean view. So is is good and then this one this one i hate the colors on it i really really dislike the choice of colors on this one i don't like on anything like even when i wear clothes or something i i'm not quite into these uh, colors then we have cerulean bandit 
not bad. And then finally, the last recorder is Child's Play. Uh, and again, I'm not into these colors. I don't quite like it. Some people might do, which is totally fine. So that's uh, four recorders for the Spitfire. And then finally, we have the L-Star. The L-Star already has five recorders. That's insane. A weapon that was added in Season 2, if I'm not wrong, uh, and already has five recolors. That's a lot. Uh, and it's not. Yeah. Okay. So we have Fragger, which is this one. I think this is the latest recorder for the L-Star. Then we have Blue Giant. I think this was the first one. Then the Aristocrat. Not a... This one is actually quite nice. Then Blue Carbon. Another nice recolor for the Yellstar and Oxidized Envy. I think on the Yellstar they have is it's like the, the quality is is kind of decent, is is quite is quite good. They they have done some good work on the on the Yellstar. Then Lombo. First recolor for the Lombo is the Trailblazer. Which is this one. It's got that season one theme uh, at the front. The Nightbreaker. I remember Mendo. Mendo used to love this skin. He used to wear it a lot back when the Lombo was good. Then Frigid, third recorder for the Lombo. And then the last recorder was. Cryogenesis. This is the fourth recolor for the for the Lombo. Kraber has five recolors as well. And again, that's that's insane. That's a lot. This is the latest one, Wasteland Finery. I love this recolor because I think the black and gold accents they match uh, quite well. Then we have the SOS. This is the first recolor for the for the Kraber. Then Life of the Party. Then we have Rescue Effort and Survival Instinct. This one is quite nice. I like this. This skin here. So that's five recorders in total for the Kraber. Triple Take. Let's see how many the Triple Take has. It's got four. The Sea Stalker, very first recorder for the Triple Take. The Body Snatcher. Under the Sun and the Resolution, latest recorder for the triple take. The charge rifle has no recolors whatsoever, which is which is, which is quite weird because well I know it's a it's a new weapon, or well, it's not that new, it's from last season, but um, some skins have are already getting the second recorder and some weapons have no recorders at all or some legends so yeah we need to get some for that then we have the sentinel which has no recorders either shotguns eva 8 has three recorders prime time very first one this one is all right then fire starter i used to love this uh, design of a skin because it's quite nice, it's really really nice, but I have to say yeah that these um, ears here or wings of the dragon have uh, do they do block your view a bit. Then Master Key, this one is quite nice, uh, really nice recolor I like. I like everything about it, it's quite nice. This is like kind of the, at least the quality that we should be getting on recolors is this one looks nice even though that it, it uh, it still has many things from the base legendary skin, but it's still a good job. Then final boss for the Mastiff. Mastiff has two recolors. Um, I think there is a third recolor, kind of a greenish one, coming for the Mastiff. So I expect that tomorrow in my in my next video. Then we have Pixel Hunter, last recolor for the Mastiff. The Mozambique has four recolors already. The Dragon Slayer, very first one. This one is quite nice. I like how uh, this thing changes depending on depending on the light. Then we have the divinity, second recolor for the Mozambique, Peter Sweet, 
monochromatic is the last one for the mosaic and peacekeeper has should be four four recolors um, so northern lights i i like this skin a lot this recolor is the one i have been using since basically almost since almost all the time since it came out because i like the colors on it and because we all want this clean view on the peacekeeper then we have clean bridge uh, this is the iron side i don't i don't like uh, and i'm not quite into these colors i think mm, something like this yellow it should be like if it were like a shiny black it would be much better in my opinion then we have red dawn this one is quite nice it's quite decent and last for the peacekeeper we have old blue this is another really nice recolor really really good job on this one you know it may look as simplistic like you just pass one color on it on it and you get the recolor but um, it just makes it look nice so sometimes it's about it can be all about the color but sometimes it's, it's also about uh, uh, working on matching good accents on the on the skin and then the last group is pistols we start with the R re45 re45 has four recolors first one is payback then we have the blue beast the neutralizer third recolor for the re45 this one is quite nice i like it and the king's rage okay so i don't like these two recolors because the co oh, actually on this one is a bit more bad on this one the colors don't stand out that much if you would go and have a look at the basic skin like this one is so outstanding it's so attractive appealing to watch so yeah they should they should keep things closer to sort of this then we have the p2020 has three recorders madame mayhem the very first recolor in one and one of the oldest recolors in the game pit viper that this one is quite nice i love this uh, design here and the viper is, is awesome tool of anubis another cool skin for the p2020 and the windman with this latest recorder that it got uh, a week ago amazing recorder i love everything about it really good choice of colors and yeah good job on that one then the dismantler another good recorder then red rocker this is the second recorder for the women this one is quite nice this one is the one i was rocking before before brass piece was released and then the third recorder is the is the sunburst this one i i don't i don't like it that much but yeah so we have two two out of four recorders that i would wear all the time because i like them i like them a lot and then and then this one would be like a third choice my third like ranking the four recorders i would give this one the third place and then this one the fourth place in those uh four and those in that list of recolors so that is it guys uh, i hope you have enjoyed the video sorry that it's a bit too long but i just wanted to showcase everything that has been all of the recorders that have been released in the game including two that don't have the recolor the, the recolor symbol so stay tuned tomorrow another amazing video about more cosmetics and see you in the next one bye bye